how do you? Hello guys, we are back in Tomb Raider Anniversary. Um, part 6. Yeah, huh? And now we're in the Coliseum. Which is still kind of unrealistic a little bit, mm -hmm. I'm guessing. Well, it's pretty much, um, when it comes to the Coliseum, it's pretty much the same, although it feels a bit shorter than the one on the PlayStation 1, which is the original game. Okay. It does feel shorter than that one. Okay, fair enough. Right. Okay. I just find it hard to believe that a Colosseum, which is like a this massive place, has a tomb in it. Mm hmm So there's not much to this level. Nah. It's quite simple. It's a very linear level in most cases. I mean, there is a bit of backtracking here and there, but for the most part, it's easier than the other one. So, yeah. I'll find it easier than the original game in most places, because there aren't as many traps as the PlayStation 1 gamers. Okay. But, yeah. Like I said, you run out of breath so quickly. In You're going the wrong way! In anniversary, you do run out of breath really quickly. <laughs> That's the thing. The good thing there is many um, air pockets for you to breathe. So yeah. Yeah. Mhm. Mm okay. So now we want to go this way. Swim, Lara, you little bitch. So I'm, I'm trying now to I'm trying to remember now what Colosseum was like in the original. My brain's very hazy. <laughs> I can remember the original because I've played it many times. Um, yeah, you would. <laughs> <laughs> of course I would. <laughs> um, I would say that I don't find it as good as the original, but then again, I find the game not as good as the original. It's still a good remake, but I prefer the first. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think that depends on the kind of gameplay style you're a fan of as well. Yeah. One thing I don't like about the new Tomb Raiders is that sometimes, you know when you can auto-climb on certain things you jump at? Sometimes Lara doesn't grab it and you think you can climb the cage, but you can't. Certain things you think you can climb on, but you can't. Okay. That's the problem I have with the newer ones. Like you, you can expect to grab that and pull yourself up. Yeah, I would have thought you could grab that and but pull you yourself up. But... <laughs> okay. I prefer cause games where you can pretty much climb on anything. Yeah. So, yeah. Because anything you can climb on and jump on, you can climb it. Yeah. <sighs> oh, look. <laughs> it's a gorilla. I can see that. I was going to make some kind of crack about how it's someone we know, but... I, no one was coming to mind, so... Okay, best not to then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shit. So the gorillas obviously look like they take a bit more abuse than they did in the... Uh, um, Original. Yeah, that's what it meant. <laughs> yeah, remember the big Coliseum area in Tomb Raider 1? Yeah. This is what it is in the remake. Okay. I don't find it nearly as big. Yeah, but it looks a little bit more, I don't know, true Modern. to the Colosseum. Mm hmm. What the fuck? What is it? That voice. That's Pierre. <laughs> <laughs> that, yes, that's supposed to be Pierre. <laughs> that's right. all I got. But I knew if someone was talking. <laughs> <laughs> Must be your imagination playing with you. Yeah, well, that wouldn't bloody surprise me, actually. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> oh, I freaking jumped. Naughty, naughty, Lara. Give a slap on the bottom for that. She's gonna have to be spanked. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. You heard the uh, news? News of what? The new console that just got revealed. Oh yeah, the Xbox One. Matthew told me about it yesterday. Um, <laughs> I don't like the sound of it though. That's all I can say in that regard. Yeah. It doesn't sound like a very. It doesn't sound like a console worth buying. 
But then um, again, we don't know. Yeah, I'm going to leave it until E3, and if they still haven't impressed me at E3, I'm not going to buy it. Uh huh. I mean, there's a lot of things that are just ma proved massive deal breakers. Like, no used games without paying a fee? Fuck you. I know. <laughs> That's what I thought. So the fuck kind of, you, Microsoft. I've got to say that. Oh, fuck now. Ah! Rape! <laughs> Gain rape. Move. Animal rape! <laughs> But yeah, what was that you were saying? I can't remember now. We were talking about the Xbox One. Yeah, and how you can't play used games on it. Yeah. I do think that, that I do really think <laughs> that is a stupid idea. Whoever came up with that Microsoft needs to get freaking fired. <laughs> <laughs> well, they probably will if Microsoft ends up losing money. I mean, I heard something about their stocks going down like after, right after their reveal. So. Now, here's one thing I don't get, right? If I run and jump that, you'd expect to grab that, right? Yeah, And pull I yourself would. up. But you can't. She's not strong enough. <laughs> in two main of four, I could just walk up it, jump, pull myself up. There you go. Yeah. But in this game, you can't do that because you can't jump nearly as high. It just looks like it's a bit of scenery then, if that's the case. Like, it's just not there for any purpose other than to look at it. Well, I was going to say that Underworld's much worse, though. There are stupid glitches with the, um, what's it called? The grapple. Sometimes, you know when you use the grapple on certain pla uh, platforms to climb yourself down? Sometimes you can sometimes let go for no reason. Okay. Which is stupid. And you would expect to climb that, but you can't. Yeah, you, you kind of already pointed that out with the other one. <laughs> yeah. I mean, there are things you can climb, but there are things you can't climb, which I find stupid. Yeah. Poor Schlara. Push. Push like your wife depends on it. Hopefully she's strong enough to push it. Of course she is. Look at her. I'm not strong enough. That's my gag. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how you get up there. Yeah, huh? Yeah, it would have been easier if we could have just climbed up there, but whatever. Mm -hmm. Evidently, no, they, they didn't want us to do that. More lions. Mm -hmm. You be alone, lions. Oh, God. Some of these jumps kind of look a bit tricky. I don't know if that's just me. Well, it can't be as tricky as the classics, and in Trek classics, it's much harder. Yeah, that's, that's what I mean. It must just be me. Okay. Here again. <laughs> uh huh. So we can put the key in the stock here. And then we can climb that um, ladder. Lots and lots of checkpoints. Mm hmm. <sighs> There's only one artifact in this level. And did you get it? Well, I can go and get it now. I'm going to go get it now, it's just over there. Oh, okay. <laughs> there it is. Okay, that's uh, it's well hidden. Come on, Lara, swing like your booty depends on it. It probably does. Ah! <laughs> And there's the artifact, so now we've got that. That's just for art galleries and such, like I mentioned before. Okay, fair enough. And now I want to make my way back, because there are some magnums up there. Okay. Magnums, is it? Uh-huh. The actual yep. guns. Yep. Okay. 
Well, get on it then. <laughs> <laughs> At least it keeps something consistent from the first game, because in the first game you can get the Magnums in the Colosseum. So it does stay true to the first game. Yeah. In that regard. See, I don't mind games that like make a slight <sighs> differences here and there. As long as they're sensible. Mm-hmm. And it does seem to be kind of sensible. Mm-hmm. Again. And it's up there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Make the jump, Lara, or else you'll get spanked. <laughs> Completely spanked. Spank you. <laughs> Good girl. Let them up there. Mm -hmm. Okay. We found 50 caliber pistols. Come on, use my 45. <laughs> Melgi side reference. Yeah. Oh. Requires a lot of maneuverability then. Yeah, uh -huh. that's right. Otherwise, Lara it would have saved you trouble. Dodo. I was going to say, if you do it that way, it will save you the trouble of backtracking once again. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's that's handy. What is? Not backtracking. Mm-hmm. Saves you the trouble. That's why I prefer doing it that way. Just drop down the slope and quickly use my grapple. Okay, so... Obviously you've got to jump again. Well, yeah, you can't stand on that. There's a big, huge rock on it. Why Lara would be able to stand on a big, huge rock that's slanted, I do not know. Neither do I. <laughs> okay. <sighs> okay, I'm guessing there's something coming. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty obvious. Where are you, Gorilla Man? So obviously with the news of the one obviously sucking at the moment, mm -hmm. potentially, um, PS4? I'm not really sure about that. The controller looks kind of miffy, but I will say the control- What? You've finished yep. the Colosseum already? Yep. What? It's that short. What? <laughs> now I'm going to go, go to the Pilis, uh, Palace Myers. Oh, I was going to say- Palace of Myers, yeah. Yeah, Palace of Myers, yeah. I was going to say, one of the lead bards, when you, you know the three lead bards in the, the original game? Yeah. In this remake, one of them is so laughably easy to get, you'll be shocked. Yeah. Yeah. More just palace than we are. So basically, like you were saying, um, you're not can't, sure on the PS4? Nah, not really. I'm not really sure what, what games to get, really. I mean, the only PS3 games I'm looking to get now is The Last of Us, really. Yeah. And Beyond Two Souls. Which looks badass. Same people who made Heavy Rain. So you're not really interested in any of the consoles, or...? Uh, not really, no. Oh. Okay. I'm more of a retro gamer. Yeah, nowadays you are. <laughs> <laughs> Kicks a shit out of the new ones. I still remember when you were, a, you, you were a kid and you said, You have to put these games behind you, you have to move on! <laughs> Like I was, like I was grieving some lost, <laughs> lost person or someone, like someone had died. <laughs> <laughs> No! It's in the past! Put it behind you! <laughs> Is that Midas's hand there? Yeah. What? Right at the beginning yes, of the Yes, exactly. Level? Yeah. That's why I'm not. That's what I was going to say. That's why I prefer Tomb Raider 1's level design, in a way. That's why I prefer it. And obviously, if she stands on it, she'll turn to gold, right? Yeah. Okay. It's more hilarious in the remake. 
Okay, and you're not going to show it? I'm going to show it near towards the end. Okay, when you've got a checkpoint behind you, obviously. Or when I know, when I've got all three lead bars. Okay, so you can just proceed straight on yep. to the end without worrying. Now, this one's very easy to get. This is the first lead bar to get. This one is so easy to get. Um, this is all you have to do, right? All you got to do is go down those stairs, right? And it's there! <laughs> You'll see. That doesn't sound simple. We should, we should just have to walk down the stairs and there it is. <laughs> That's simple. God, fucking monkeys. Everywhere. Before they're gorillas. Monkeys, gorillas, what the fuck ever. <laughs> Evidently there's loads of hungry animals. So what we got to do is pull all three of these with your grapple. Right. And that's it, right? And you just grab it and that's it. Okay. That was so, so hard. Those tomb raiders that come in and try and find our beloved treasures, they'll never figure out how to get this one. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> that easy. Lead bar. Yep. Yeah. So now there's two more to get. Yeah, this does feel a lot shorter than the uh, original game. And you know those levers that you have to pull to open certain doors? Yeah. That's not in this remake. Yeah. Okay. That's probably for the best, right? Because I thought, uh, when I was watching it, I thought it looked pretty darn tedious. Mm -hmm. Having to pull all those levers and fiddle around with all those levers. So... I didn't mind it. I don't know. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just looking at this and thinking, oh, wow, that, that looks a lot less tedious. Mm -hmm. It sounds a whole lot less tedious, cause, but then again, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I haven't played the game. It just maybe it just sounds a bit tedious for me having to constantly press a bunch of switches, rather than just being able to get on with it, if you will. Uh huh. And then that, yeah, no, that's where we uh, differ in opinion a lot of the time. Uh -huh. we, we're, we're different gamers in that regard. I prefer more difficult, challenging games. So yeah. Well, I prefer something more straightforward, a little bit more linear. Mm -hmm. um, whereas you probably prefer... Stuff like Oblivion and that. Yeah, more exploration titled games where you... Spend ages trying to figure out where to go. Ah! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> she should have grabbed that! Fucking hell. I think she was slightly too far to the left. I'm not entirely sure on that. I could be wrong. But it looked like she was slightly too far to the left. So, uh, yeah. How many times have we been in this room now? <laughs> Only three times. Only three times? Mm-hmm. <sighs> Do it. Run! <sighs> it's going to pick me off. I'll shut up then. Thank you. That's better. Oh, God. Only the most acrobatic Tomb Raiders in the world would be able to progress through these. Mm-hmm. I mean, really. I, I jumped! Because ah! I was about to jump and then she just glitched through the corner and then she fell to her death. Dun dun dun! Okay. Try again. Well, at least you hit a checkpoint. Good. Yeah, that's true. So it's not like you have to start over. Mm-hmm. That would have been annoying. Okay. Easier way of doing it. 
Okay then. Um, so we need a second lead bar. Well, no, we've got to pull the lever first. Oh god. So there are still levers to pull. It's just not as. Um, you just got to pull levers. Prominent or as lot, you know, as much of them as there was in the first. Game. Pretty much. <sighs> I will say Lara's home in this game is better than the first game because. Okay, it may not have the charm of the first one, but there is more things to do in it. Hello, Midas. And there is puzzle solving, whereas Tomb Raider 1's just a basic training level. Yeah. Oh, Midas. He's totally armless. Mm -hmm. There was a kind of double meaning in that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fair enough. He's okay. armless. He's yeah. got no arms. And he's harmless as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, sorry, it was lame. That's not that lame. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goody. Come along now, Lara. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> now, remember the fire room in the original game? Yes. Honestly, I prefer this. Better. Yes. Okay. It's more challenging, it's more... You'll, you'll see. I thought you bitched... A, I can't remember. Did you bitch about the challenge last time, or...? Well, there are a couple of challenging sections in Anniversary, more so than Tomb Raider Legends, so... Tomb Raider Anniversary is quite easy, but there were a couple of challenging moments. Okay. Which is why I prefer it over Legend. Ah, oh, prefer it over Legend, fair enough. Mm-hmm. I can kind of understand why, uh... Oh, God. Was that meant to happen? I was meant to jump in there because I forgot to pull a lever, which you need to, to raise this. Then you can climb all the way to the top, pull that lever, and then can proceed to get the lead bar. Left bar. Yeah, left bar. Whatever. <sighs> Still got to appreciate how good the graphics are. Uh-huh. I mean, I know I've gone on about it for, what, more than once now, but, wow. <laughs> uh -huh. I don't like the blur effect that it has, though, when fire goes around. That kind of, it's kind of bugging. That might just be me. Uh-huh. Unless you play it on the PC. It looks a lot better on the PC. Yeah, well, it would, wouldn't it? It's PC. <laughs> okay. That's the other lever. Uh-huh. Oh, my. More fire. Wow, Lara, you're on fire. So just being near the fire just caused your health to drain? Pretty much. Seriously, I cannot imagine Lara sat in front of a nice warm fire at home. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just mean she wouldn't be able to, would she, if it, if it drains her health. Like, if all you want to do is just sit in front of a nice warm fire, warm yourself up after you... And her health really starts draining cold. and she stays there for 30 seconds, she gets killed. Yeah. Shit. All I wanted was to warm well, up. Well, no, better, better, <laughs> yeah, better yet, she goes to take a hot bath and then if she's, if she's in there for 30 seconds, she'll die. Yeah. Crikey. Fire and Lara, they don't go together. A little bit more. There we go. If I'm that fucking ladder. How many other levers are there? Just this last one. And then we can get the lead lead bar. Yeah. Bar's about to say lead bar again. <laughs> yeah, that seems to be your habit. Uh huh. And they want Lara soup. Mm hmm. Or even better, Lara stew. Sounds pleasant. Yeek. Wouldn't catch meat in that yuck. Mm
Where are you going now? Oh, I see. We're gonna die. <laughs> oh, not exactly. Now you've got to jump over there, I'm guessing. Uh-huh. And then up, right? Uh-huh. Yep. She's on fire, fire, fire. Reminds me of GTA 3. That's kind of what the reference was. Uh-huh. Is that it? Yeah. Uh -huh. Two lead bars. Mm-hmm. Only one more to go. Whoa. Those crocodiles are after you again. I can see that. <laughs> I know, but I'm just so good at stating the obvious. Mm-hmm. I mean, how could I not be? <laughs> oh, God! Monkey rape! Oh, that's actually kind of spooky. Oh, God, you missed the hand. I was lucky enough not to touch it. <laughs> okay. And the last one can be found where? In that door there. We've got to find the lever to open it first. Okay. And that's all the way back in Peru. Oh, great. <laughs> what joy. Oh, just kill the bloody monkeys, please. Die, you fucking monkey. Naughty monkey. Whoa. And suddenly there was no monkey. They disappeared. So with these, um... With these lead bars, can you get them in any order? Yeah, you can. Okay. So it lets you choose, like the first game. That's good. <sighs> Another health pack. That's the lever, right? Yep, that opens the door that we need to go through to get the last lead bar. One more lead bar later. <laughs> uh huh. Okay. Through the open door. It's the, that time of year, so... <laughs> uh -huh. Hay fever. Hay fever drowns us all. Unfortunately. Fucking annoying. <sighs> That's what it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so this one isn't... Oh, excuse me. This one isn't too difficult to get, is it? No, it's not. The only thing that's difficult about this part is trying to get a relic. Because let me tell you something, getting the relic is a fucking pain in the butt. Why? Because what they want you to do is when you pull the sleever, all of these platforms will come up. And you've got to jump from platform to platform and get all the way over there. Right? Okay, but is, is it on like on a time limit? Yes. Yeah, I, I thought it had to have been. I mean... Whoa! Fuck you, Spikes. Now you've got to do it again. What joy. Do you want me to skip ahead? No, it's alright. Because uh, the part's near enough at an end anyway. Yeah. Right, so we'll see you guys in the next part. See you later.